And Michael, over, over, uh, Michael, over to your left. You know, we've had, you know, a pandemic that we've all been victims of. And, you know, we've, we've kind of gone into this revolution, you know, um, you know, socially within, within our own communities. And we want to find a way for us to like, you know, tell stories that, um, that gave that, that fed our soul, you know, that made us, you know, you know, that, that inspired us, that made us laugh, that, that, that made us, you know, remember what it was like to fall in love, that, that made it, what made us feel like, you know, that, you know, that, that what, it was, what it was like to be a child again. So we wanted to give people an opportunity to find relatability through cinema. You know, it was a timing thing, you know, I think uh, I've always chosen to be very strategic and, you know, and, and, and um, wanting to speak when it, when it, uh, it really makes an impact and it really matters. And this, and this, you know, what's going on right now, you know, I can't, I can't, I can't be silent and I, I want to work and evolve and grow with people who feel that same sense of urgency. And, that, and that's kind of how we came, came to this point. Same way that, I mean, me and Ramina are usually like in step when it comes to, you know, our creative instincts and kind of how we feel. You know, it's accountability. I think I think that's a big thing nowadays. You know that that's 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 going around. That's 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 in that's in season right now is accountability, and that that means we have to hold, you know, people that are close to us accountable. That means we have to hold our business partners accountable. We have to hold, you know, um, our neighbors accountable. We have to hold we we they, we have to hold each other accountable right now. And I feel like, you know, yeah. If you, if you benefited off me, if we're, if we're if we're if we're in this together, then things I care about, you should care about. You know, it, it's what we're doing right now while we have the, 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 the energy and the momentum, you know, let's continue to keep the conversation pushing forward. But, um, but now it's in a, in a very, let's address the disease, not just the symptoms, you know? And I think we're having a chance to really have a high level holistic conversation right now while we're in it. So once we, and then we, you know, hold each other accountable moving forward. The dream you dreamed about having this career mm -hmm. has already exceeded the dream or are you living the dream? Did it look like this? Exceeded the dream. It exceeded the dream. It exceeded the dream. At 32 in a few days, <laughs> you've exceeded the dream. Yeah, I have a belated birthday, by the way. Once the protests are over, all that energy going into all of that has to go into holding ourselves accountable and holding our teams and everyone else accountable. And We've talked about that in terms of every aspect of our business and how to put real process behind it that makes sure people are accountable. It's not about intention anymore. The good intention period is over. It's time for action and accountability, and we are going to make sure that those checks and balances exist. Absolutely.